Welcome to the Summertime Kitchen at DiabetesEveryday.com. If you've ever actually had a zucchini plant, you know they just keep giving and giving, and there's only so much zucchini you can give away. Well, just as you've run out of recipes and grateful friends, fellow registered dietitian Marlene Cook is coming to the rescue with a fabulous recipe from her book, Eat More of What You Love. We have talked before about how casseroles aren't always consistent with managing diabetes. Many include dense carbohydrate foods like pasta, potatoes, or rice. And the creamy casseroles can be high in fat as well. But Marlene's light as a feather zucchini casserole is a diabetes delight. Sweet, but low carbohydrate, low fat, low sodium, but also creamy and rich. It's just another way my talented dietitian friends prove that healthy and delicious can go together. Ready? Here's what you need. Four teaspoons tub margarine, six cups or about one and a half pounds coarsely grated zucchini, one cup finely chopped onion, one half cup chopped red bell pepper, one tablespoon all-purpose flour, one cup low-fat evaporated milk, one teaspoon Dijon mustard, one half teaspoon garlic salt, one eighth teaspoon freshly ground black pepper, three quarters cup shredded, reduced fat sharp cheddar cheese, the whites from two large eggs, one quarter cup panko breadcrumbs. To prepare this casserole, preheat your oven to 400 degrees and lightly spray a nine by nine by two inch baking dish with nonstick spray. Now, in a large nonstick skillet, heat one teaspoon of the margarine over medium heat. Add the zucchini, onion, and pepper, and cook for 10 to 15 minutes until the liquids have evaporated. Transfer this mixture to a bowl and set aside. Add two teaspoons of margarine to the skillet over medium heat. Then, add the flour and cook for one minute while constantly stirring. Now add the milk, Dijon, garlic salt, and pepper, and whisk until this mi mixture thickens. About four or five minutes should do the trick. Remove this sauce from the heat, stir in the cheese, stir this in with the zucchini, and let cool for a few minutes. Meanwhile, beat the egg whites in a small bowl until soft peaks form. Gently fold the egg whites into the cooled zucchini and pour the casserole mix into your baking dish. Melt the final teaspoon of margarine. Combine with your breadcrumbs, sprinkle this on top, and bake for 30 to 40 minutes until heated through. And here we are, light as a feather zucchini casserole. And does this ever smell wonderful? Marlene's recipe makes eight servings, and each serving is 90 calories, 10 grams carbohydrate, two grams fiber, three grams total fat, seven grams protein, and 250 milligrams sodium. Now, that is a healthy casserole, but it's still creamy and cheesy. Aren't we lucky we know Marlene? Thanks for joining me today. You realize you not only will enjoy this fabulous dish tonight, but you'll also know from now on where to get rid of all that zucchini. See you next time.